Right, this is how I created multiple events in Outlook using a .hol file. I've never used one before, but you just pull up a text document and when you go to save it, go to save as, select all files, and just change the extension to hol and click save. So this is kind of the format it's looking for. This is the overarching name and this is the number of events. So this is it in the Outlook calendar has the overarching name and then the event that we listed right here, Independence Day. So th this might make it a little easier to read here. So this is the name. And then it's looking for year, year, month, month, day, day. One thing to remember here is to do a comma, space, and then your date. Otherwise, it'll throw an error.